ready? Yeah. What is it? I can't wait. Oh, Strawberry, it's beautiful. What's it called? Oh, Lallyberry Rhubarb Surprise. Well, go ahead. Dig in. Let me know what you think. as the best dessert chef in the Berry Bitty world has just gone up another notch. Aww. <laughs> Thanks, Apple. This beats any dessert that my sister and I have ever created in our lives times ten. Well, what do you think? No, it's just the agony of agreeing with my sister. <laughs> oh, so... <laughs> Thank you, everyone. This dessert shouldn't just be for us. Your reputation should be known around the Berry Bitty world. I second what Apple said, and I third it. Oh, thank you. But just knowing you guys like my desserts... Oh, that makes me happy. Mmm. 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 That did come out all right, didn't it? <laughs> all right. It's perfect. Yeah, it's Morning, Strawberry. <sighs> Morning, Apple. Whoa, oh. Oh. Mm. What's going on? I'm getting messages from all over the world. People wanting to order Strawberry's famous Olalyberry Rhubarb Surprise. How did it get to be famous? Oh, uh, I think I can answer that question. May I? Um, sure. Hey, that's my Olalyberry Rhubarb Surprise. Famous O'Lally Berry Rhubarb Surprise. That's my new food review section on my Berry Best Bit site. I call it Yummy Yums. And the honor of my first food review went to you. Berry Bitty City, home to Strawberries Cafe, premiered a fantastically fabulous dessert. Yours truly was honored to be first to dip a spoon in the ultimate taste treat. <laughs> O'Lally Berry Rhubarb Surprise. Delectably delicious, delightful flavor, taste-tempting texture, a feast for the eyes and the taste buds. <laughs> you have to try it to believe it. Oh, Apple, you're so sweet. Ah, oh, thanks, Strawberry. And every word of it is true. Like I say on my Berry Best Bits page, I call them like I taste them. And I've tasted them all around the Berry Bitty world. What can I say? Your desserts are incredible. Aw, oh, thanks. I'm just sorry I have to disappoint all your readers. What do you mean? I'm getting messages from people all over the world trying to place orders for my O'Lally Berry Rhubarb Surprises. And I... Oh, here's another one. I'll have to tell them it's only available here at my cafe. Wait, wait, wait. No, what if it's not only available at your cafe? What? Where else? 24-7, around the globe. All dessert, all the time. That's it! Huh? Oh, Ali Berry Rhubarb Surprise! What if people can get it everywhere? Delivered right to their door! You mean, like a mail order business? Exactly! They order your dessert online, you mail it to them. Do you think that many people would really want to order my... How many's that? 112. Just so far this morning. And just for that one dessert. But why just one dessert? Strawberry, all your desserts are great. Think of it. You and Sweet and Sour could make them. I'll taste test them and review them in my Berry Best Bits page. And we ship them all over the world. What do you think? I think it sounds... big. Big? It's colossal! I can see it now. 
Berry Bitty Cookery Company. Fresh desserts direct from Strawberry's Kitchen to your door. What do you think? Well, it sounds wonderful. 172. Are we going to tell them no? Or are we going to fill those orders? Strawberry's latest creation, which she calls Mucho Mocha Mango Mousse, gets five yummy yum stars out of five. And a bonus, mmm, that's good, from your humble reviewer. And so until next time when your tummy says, let's eat, this is Apple Dumplin' in Berry Bitty City, saying I call them like I taste them. Oh, Apple, that's just wonderful. And the orders keep coming in. This is so exciting. You're making Strawberry famous. It's her recipes that are doing it. I'm just the messenger sharing the good news with the world. Sweet. Your peach parfait's up. Gotta get back to the kitchen. Okay. What's next on the menu? Great, grape grandy. <sighs> Mmm. 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 Strawberry, you have done it again. Simple words fail to describe the great goodness. The incredibly great goodness of the latest and tastiest wonder from the creative kitchen of Strawberry Shortcake. <gasps> Chew! Morning, Strawberry. A delightful dish called Great Great Brandy. Morning, Apple. Uh, what's the matter? Got a cold? Nah, allergy. I get it every year when the purple puff petals are in bloom. I can't smell a thing. Well, this will make you feel better. Wait till you read my review of your great great grandy. Oh, you liked it? Loved it. Another hit. <laughs> great, thanks. Here's your latest orders. Three dozen O'Lally Berry Rhubarb Surprises, 10 Gooseberry Geysers, two with extra nuts, 17 Strawberries Fabulous Fig Frappes, half a dozen Nana Num Nums, and a Mucho Mocha Mango Mousse. Uh, two Mucho Mocha Mango Mousses. Excellent. Oh, uh, almost forgot. New cake recipe I made last night for you to taste test. Cake? I absolutely, positively love cake. Well, I hope you like this one. I know I will. Oh, pretty frosting. Blueberry, I got a problem. 
sort of a big problem, actually. A really big problem. Maybe you can help me out? Well, certainly. If I can. What exactly is the problem? Well, you see, the word exactly, that's that's uh, part of the problem. Saying things exactly, that's a, uh, ooh, no, uh... It's kind of like a, what do you say when you want to say something but can't find the right words problem. Oh, I understand. So, what kind of things do you want to say? Well, <laughs> see, that's right there, another problem. It's not the kind of thing I want to say, it's what I don't want to say. See? I don't want to say the words I want to say, so I gotta find some other words to say instead. I think I have something that'll help. You do, you do? <laughs> oh, that'd be great. Okay, this is a thesaurus. You look up any word and it tells you all the other words that mean something similar. And the ones that mean the opposite. Whoa. And this one, this is my trusty dictionary. Tells you what all the words mean. Whoa, look at all these words. Isn't it incredible? Thousands, thousands of words. Any words you need, what they mean, how to spell them, how to say them. I mean, it's just, uh. Enjoy! Oh, Blueberry, thanks! I'll bring them back as soon as I'm done! What can I possibly say about Strawberry's new Very Berry Spice Royale cake? Words simply fail to describe it. Its color is beautifully exquisite, glamorously captivating. Its creamy texture is creamier than any texture I've ever experienced. Soft and silky as a cloud. Yes, dessert lovers, I can tell you definitely, absolutely, and for sure, one taste of Very Berry Spice Royale will prove indubitably and irrefutably that it is an out of the ordinary, unexpected, and may I say, unique cake eating experience. This is Apple Dumplin' in Berry Bitty City, saying I call him like I taste him. Sounds like she loved it. <laughs> Sounds like she needs to get a bigger thesaurus before she runs out of words. Hi, Strawberry. Better flour some cake pans. The orders are going to be pouring in. Very Berry Spice Royale? Another great review from Apple. Oh, good. I'm glad she liked it. So how's the allergy? Getting better, thanks. The purple puff petals are almost finished blooming. I... Excuse me. <clears throat> Very Bitty Cookery Company desserts direct to your door. Strawberry speaking. Yes? Uh-huh, yes, this is Strawberry Shortcake. Well, I... I'd be honored to. Of course. <laughs> Certainly, Your Majesty. Your Majesty? Yes, it'll arrive on time. Thank you, Your Majesty. That was the Queen of Berryvania. <gasps> She saw Apple's review of my Very Berry Spice Royale cake. She wants to order one for her inaugural ball. <laughs> Big enough to feed a hundred people. Oh, <gasps> oh, <wow>. right. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Well, we'd better get busy. Higher! Higher! Trust me, I'm trying! Hi, Blueberry. Brought your books back. Thanks, Apple. Did they help? Yep, perfectly. Problem solved. Well, looks like the mail order business is booming. And it's thanks to you. Oh, no. <laughs> Just calling them like I chased them. Oh, don't be modest. You know royalty is reading your very best bits page? No, come on. They're delivering a 16-layer cake that the Queen of Berryvania ordered for her inaugural ball. Wow, that's great! <gasps> uh, do you happen to know, uh, what, what kind of cake it was? Very Berry Spice Royale. The one you raved about in your review. <gasps> Oh, 
It's so nice when the purple puff petals close and my nose can unstuff. <laughs> I bet it's nice to be able to smell and taste your own cooking again. Is it ever? I couldn't even... Berry Bitty Cookery Company, desserts direct to your door. Strawberry speak... Oh, hello, Your Majesty. I beg your pardon. <gasps> Burnt berry biscuits! Oh, excuse me, Your Majesty, but... Yes? Uh, yes, of course. I'll take care of everything. Strawberry? What is it? Tell you later. It's the cake. The Queen's cake. I gotta go! Put it back together again? with a last-minute request to add a frosting inscription. <sighs> Phew! She doesn't know. <gasps> What's this? Oh, we're sorry, Strawberry. I sneezed. We crashed. Cake broke. We thought we could fix it. We should have just told you the truth. I should have told you the truth, too. Apple? What are you doing here? Tell me the truth about what? Your cake. I just couldn't find a way to say what was wrong with it. So I found a way to say everything that was right about it and left the bad news part out. What bad news part? The cake didn't taste very good. It didn't? No, don't do that! Why? What's wrong with it? <laughs> <laughs> So that's what happened. What? I put in persimmon pepper instead of persimmon powder. They're right next to each other on my spice rack. With my nose stuffed up, I couldn't smell the difference. Hi, sweet. Strawberry. No, everything's fine, but we're going to need another cake. I'm on my way back to help you. Thanks. See you in a few. Strawberry, I'm so sorry. I just wanted to protect your reputation. It's okay, Apple. You never have to be afraid to tell me the truth about what you think of my cooking, good or bad. Just call them like you taste them. News reports from last night's exclusive inaugural ball for the Queen of Berryvania say it was the event of the year. Lots of high fashion, ballroom full of famous royalty, gigantic dinner attended by blah, blah, blah. Ah, here. The Queen herself proclaimed the highlight of the evening was the sumptuous dessert from Berry Bitty City, Strawberry Shortcake's Berry Berry Spice Royale Cake. The most delicious I have ever tasted. Another order for Very Berry Spice Royale! Mm. 
<laughs> Later. Mm, mm, mm. Right now, we're all on a cake break. Indubitably. Strawberry shortcake. What are you up to today? I'm creating ways to make flowers different sizes, both very big and very small. Even if you don't have a whole lot of room, you can still have plenty of flowers in bloom. <laughs> That's a very clever idea. Strawberry? It certainly is a fine morning to enjoy the flowers. Oh, well, I'm not just enjoying them. I'm going to make a new perfume with pieces of the petals. Oh, nice. Yeah, nice. But it's going to be part of my new spring fashion line, my very best ever. So I want it to be really super special. Well, with all these flowers to choose from, you should have something really special in no time. Goodbye. <laughs> Today. But Quilting Club is your favorite. Is something wrong? Yeah. This. I promised the princess I'd make waiters for all the berrykins for their annual jam stomping. Dozens and dozens of them. And I thought it would be easy because the berrykins are so small. But it turns out making something so small is actually so hard. You see, to make them watertight, they need little itty-bitty teensy-weensy stitches. Too tiny for my sewing machine. And they're so hard to see. Oh, dear. Oh, that's too bad. Poor Raspberry. Oh. Oh, dear. Oh, Raspberry. Oh. If only those bitty berrykins were the same size as us, at least then I could see what I'm doing. Six dozen to go. Oh, no. I could make them in no time if they didn't have to be so... so... so little! Wow. Hey! 
you know that the berrykins were bigger. Not only would this job be easier, but bigger berrykins could stop that much more jam. What's up? Okay, okay, everybody. They're too big, but I have just a way to make them fit perfectly. Just hold still while I. Oh, nice. Uh, did I smell bad or something? Uh, no. Uh, patience. Try the waiters on. Ta da! Can I try some of that? Why? <laughs> well, sure. Here you go. Great! <laughs> oh, wow! <laughs> Indeed. 
for whatever size you need. So maybe if Raspberry makes more perfume and you mix it in with the other spray... But why does you need to mix it with my perfume? My spray doesn't work that way. It takes more time. So something about the perfume must have caused the change when it was mixed with Berry Can Bloom spray. Then it's up to you two. We need you to mix some special perfume. <laughs> I'm just about done here, Barry Kid Bloom. Let's go. you used this morning? No. That one is over... here. <gasps> oh, very good sparkles. Well, I don't see anything. Too small for you to see, but not for me. Oh, so it wasn't just your growth spray and my perfume, but the sparkles too? <gasps> it's a good thing you're so small, or we'd never have figured that out. Sparkles I can make, but I don't know how many it will take. This time for sure. works on a hat. But it might be best to try another test. Oh, we did it, we did it! Bacon Bloom and I found a way to shrink the Bearkins back to normal! That's terrific! Great news! We knew you could do it! Way to go, Raspberry! Yay, Raspberry! We need lots of sparkles. to match the right kinds of sparkles. Let's try again. This time, blue goes first. Uh, you might want to sort of duck. Right. 
running. <gasps> if they can't run the berry works, then no one is making Glimmerberry juice. What happens to Berry Bitty City when the juice runs out? Oh, this is absolutely awful. I thought making the Berrykins bigger would be helpful. I didn't think I'd be affecting all of Berry Bitty City. Right now, we're the only ones small enough to run the Berry Works. You know, you're right. Just show me what to do. I helped cause this problem. Now I'm gonna help fix it. I'll help too. Me too. Me too. Let's go, girls. All right. Raspberry, we're going to need more of your perfume. Uh, uh, but the princess needs me to help run the berry works. And besides, I'm much too small to reach any of the flowers. That's not so. Even though we're bitty, we can do big things. Especially if some of the berrykins reach the flowers for you. Oh, I just thought of something. While we're running the berry works, who's gonna run our shops? Fruit salad, coming up as soon as I figure out how to make it. Hmm. Where's my waffles? Now pass the tea on table five. Where's the waffle or is that table four? How do you make a waffle? Don't ask me, I've never cooked before. Neither have I. Run it, play. Look at all of these. What do we do? Where are they supposed to go? I know. We'll sort them by color. He's right. Dips on green. What a great idea. So, what do we do? Whatever the Barricans used to do. Come on. Mm, that one. I sure wish we could do it the way the berry can do it. They make it look so easy, but it's not. to change you just to make things easier for me. Oh, I ended up making things awful for all of Berry Bitty City. And now we'll mix another batch to change you and your friends back to normal. Things are back to normal. You know, 
I never wished the Berrykins were bigger, but I didn't really appreciate how important it is that everyone in Berry Bitty City is different from one another. Me too. Same here. Yep. So thanks to you and your potion, we actually found out what a big contribution the Berrykins make. No matter how small they are. And how much better they could run the Berry Works than we could. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone has their own special contribution to make, no matter how big or small. The Berrykins have theirs. <laughs> and we have ours. I know you've had a busy day, but we still have to stomp jam tomorrow. Oh, and I did promise you Berrykin-sized waiters. Hmm, maybe I can get Berrykin Balloon to make me small again so I can... How about if we just help you make more waiters? <laughs> enough of the limelight, so I hope you don't mind, Strawberry, but the Berry Big City Bitty Games needs a band for the opening ceremony. They called me, but I suggested your band, and sent a tape. And they said yes! <laughs> There's so much to do. I have to pack. But what do I pack? Oh, uh, I'll need a jacket if it's cold. And shorts if it's hot. Galoshes if it rains. <laughs> Take it easy, Raspberry. You don't even know when we're going. When are we going, Cherry? Tomorrow. <gasps> Tomorrow? There's so much to do. Wait, Wait for, for us. us! Wow. We're going to Berry Big City. That's... A long way. <laughs> uh, uh how, how are we gonna get there? Oh, I thought we'd just take my tour bus. Oh! 
Uh, how long will we be gone? A long time, I bet. <sighs> well, I better get packing. Me too. Are you coming, Orange? Yeah, right behind you. We'll be taking my bus to Berry Big City. Do you think it'll make the trip okay? Hmm. Well, if anybody can do it, it's probably me. <gasps> Wonderful! And could you do one more thing with the bus? Hmm. When do you need it? Tomorrow. Hmm. <gasps> Tomorrow? <laughs> There's so much to do. Where's my sprocket wrench? When we're a team, we can do anything. We're invincible. Let's make a plan. Together we can. We're invincible. Ah, strawberry. Would you have any of that marvelous mulberry pie? The very best pie in Berry Bitty City. <laughs> Why, thank you, Berry Kim Bloom. Right away. What is this? Don't tell me. You're rearranging the cafe? No. You're looking for a treasure? No. No. You're 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 going on a trip? Yes! <laughs> All the way to very big city! Oh, a magnificent metropolis. I haven't been there since. <gasps> what? <gasps> if you're there and I'm here, how will I get any pie? Oh, uh, that's a very good question. Hiya, Orange. What you doing? Where are you going? And why? We're all going away on a long trip. <sighs> but what about us? Where will we get things like this? And that? And these? <gasps> Where will my customers go? Uh, what will happen to us? We'll be lost! A critical matter indeed. What will happen to us and what will happen to Berry Bitty City? There'll be no one to take care of my store. Or Lemon's Beauty Salon, Blueberry's Bookshop, Plum's Dance Studio, Cherry's Music Lessons, Strawberry's Cafe, anything! Maybe we can show the Berrykins how to run things while we're gone. Brilliant plan! We, the Berrykins, shall take charge! For duty, for honor, for Berry Bitty City! Yay! Don't forget the scent stems! My customers love them! Check. When do I give the facial? After you set out the magazines. You want to make the salon experience a pleasure. Got it. Pleasure. Now, Mud? Okay, I think you're ready to... Oh! Uh, oh, my! Oh! Oh! <gasps> Berrican Bell! What? Did I miss a spot? I think we're gonna need a little more practice. I'll have the tossed salad, please. Tossing the salad! Tossing the tossed salad! Oh, that was... Very good, but next time, don't forget the plate. Oh! Well, it's, uh, different. When reading aloud, you must create the proper mood for your listener. Yes, the mood. Yes. <laughs> under B. I suppose I'll find the missing red pepper under R. Hmm. Pepper goes in the P section. And sweet basil does not go under S. It may be sweet, but it goes in B for basil, sweet or not. This isn't 
working. They're doing the best they can, but oh, there's no way I can leave them in charge of my store. What are you saying? I'm saying that I'll just have to stay here. The rest of us go on without you? I'm sorry, Strawberry. But Orange, we need you in the band. Maybe if you show the Berrykins exactly what they need to know to run your store while you're gone, I'm sure they could get it right next time. Oh, okay. Let's give it another try. There! <laughs> How's that? Hmm. Now then, let's see. Oh, would you look at that? Oh, uh, never mind. That's where it's supposed to be. Aha! No, I guess that does go there. All in all, it's more or less basically perfect. Yeah! <laughs> Phew! <laughs> now you can go on the trip with us. <laughs> Looks that way, huh? Strawberry and the Sweet Beats Band tour bus. <laughs> well, what do you think? Fantastic! Oh, oh Barrican Bruce, it's beautiful. Well, I figured if you're going to Berry Big City, why not go in style? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> We were supposed to leave an hour ago. What's keeping her? She's just having a little trouble deciding what to pack. She'll be here any... Um... Minute... Uh, we're gonna need a bigger bus. I'm afraid there's not enough room for all of that, Orange. But I, I can't leave any of it behind. Not even two dozen jars of assorted jams and jellies? Well, I could maybe take just one dozen. Your store's entire stock of tape, paper clips, and envelopes? Well, you never know when you're gonna need. Come on, girls. Let's get the rest of this loaded on the bus. begin. Here's a nice book of nursery rhymes that I... No! Not that one! Please, this one! It's a lot better! Really? Well, uh, the case of the slinking, slinking slinker? Oh, my, <laughs> that sounds a bit <clears throat> frightening. But it's science! <sighs> Oh, well, then, uh, once upon a time, there was a slinking slinker who... who... Hold on. Oh, dear. <laughs> well, um, are we sure we wouldn't rather hear these quaint and charming little nursery rhymes? Slinking slinker! Slinking slinker! A slinking slinker who had long, sharp, glistening teeth and a growl as loud as a foghorn. Oh, this sounds dreadful. <laughs> this will be so much fun! I can't believe we're actually going! Aren't you excited, Orange? Orange? Is something wrong? Stop the bus! <laughs> what is it? What's the matter? I just remembered I forgot to bring my tea. <laughs> tea? We can get some in Berry Big City. 
Not my special blend. It's my own blend. Mine. My very own. I cannot get it anywhere else. I... I guess there's time to go back. And the slinking slinker slinked into the night, and nobody ever knew what happened to it, and that's all the end! Yay! Read it again! Read it again! No, no, no. It's past my... Uh, er, past your bedtime. Uh, come along now, come along. Oh, Off you go. Get to bed. Pleasant dreams. <laughs> Don't think about... about that awful slinking slinker. Hey! Ah! Is everything all right, Berrykin Bloom? All right? <laughs> How could it be all right with that slinking slinker slinking about? Slinking slinker? Mm, that doesn't sound good. <laughs> I should say, slinking slinkers are only the most terrifying creatures in existence. I read it in a science book. And you say there's one around here? Here, there, no telling where. That's how it is with slinking slinkers, you know. They slink. Well, I'm not scared. Why should I be afraid of a... Let's get Orange's tea so we can be on the road again. No, oh, a slinking slinker. Oh, goodness me. I'm sure there's a simple explanation. What was that? And th th that? We have to do something. We must protect Berry Bitty City while the girls are gone. We promised. Let's keep this to ourselves. No need to alarm the whole city. Hmm. I have an idea. Oh, I almost couldn't find it. Those barricans have my store too organized. Come on, let's get going. Listen, a whole army of them. We must defend the city. Stop the guns! <laughs> what now? I left the hose running in the garden. I think uh, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Well, that is the very best I could do with such short notice. Amazing! What is it? A slinking slinker snatcher. Watch. <laughs> Yeah, oh, I sort of thought so. Just a little farther. This is the last place the Slinker and Slinker was almost seen. <laughs> Trap is set. Now what? Now we wait. It's very late. We don't want to wake the Berrykins. Let's be quiet. Oh, this sounds dreadful. It must be the slinking slinker. Shh. We don't want the Berrykins to think there's somebody slinking around. Yeah, but we're slinking around. What is this doing out here? Oh, see? I know the Berrykins wouldn't put things away while we were gone. What is that? Looks like some kind of... Trap! Ooh, sounds like we caught a big one. <laughs> well, hey, these look a lot like... Strawberry shortcake. What are you doing here? Uh... We needed to come back? <sighs> to check on the city? Um, sort of. But the city is fine. That's why we built this trap. To protect Berry Bitty City from the slinking slinker. 
<laughs> the slinking slinker? That's just a story. <laughs> Did the baby barricans tell you it was real? Oh, oops. <laughs> I thought it was, and then when I heard, well, someone slinking. Oh, my. <laughs> that was just us, I'm afraid. <laughs> Guess I let my worries carry me away. Running your businesses and taking care of the city were harder than we thought, but we did our very best. Didn't you trust us, Strawberry? Oh, it wasn't that. It was... It was me. I kept finding excuses to come back. I guess I was sort of afraid to leave Berry Bitty City. Aw, you were afraid? You could have told us. Oh, we understand. I'm sorry, Orange. It's no fun to feel afraid. Does it help to know we'll all be there together? It does. You're not afraid to sing, are you? And you're not afraid to put on a costume and get up on stage? No, of course not. Berry Bitty City is a very wonderful place, and we'd never leave it for long. You know that, right? What if, instead of thinking about what we're leaving behind, Think of what's ahead. A great big adventure waiting for all of us. Yeah. Our band's first performance will be very amazing. I would never want to miss that. Uh, wait a minute, if you could. I have something for Orange. If ever I have occasion to travel from home, I always take this reminder of home with me. I'd like you to have it. It's Berry Bitty City. There's my house and my store. Oh, thanks. Thanks, everybody. I think I'm ready to go now. Come on, sweet beats. We can practice our song on the way. <laughs> 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 